Sunglasses, finally we can use them all day long. Not even a cloud to be seen over Maumee, and this is a very similar look across much of Northwest Ohio, Southeast to Michigan, where it's quiet in the skies and we're okay with that. We really want a nice day and even a few nice days where we're not talking about rain and we can get outside and enjoy some heat. Now for the rest of today, no worries, no clouds coming in. We're going to have all those golden shades here on our cloud tracker. You can see we just hover right there into some of the gold colors. And even as we head into the overnight, not going to be finding a lot of cloud cover either. So we will be looking at clear conditions, not much of a cloud blanket. So that does mean that those overnight lows might not be as mild as what they were this morning. But we're taking our time kind of warming things up today. Though we have the sun, we're still sitting into the mid 60s. We have 59 though yet in Oak Harbor and even along the lakeshore. We're seeing a lot of our readings that are in the mid to upper 50s. Further inland though, that's where you're finding those 60s. Napoleon at 65. We also have uh, 63 there in Fremont, 64 in Monroe. So hopefully though, in the next couple of hours, we'll see these numbers climb and be into the 70s. That's what we have in the forecast for those who are enjoying the biggest week in American birding. Of course, that is still going on. So you're going to find that we have 70s for today and tomorrow afternoon and then 80s by Thursday. Dry weather, so any rain chances for today, you don't have to worry about it. And then we are easily looking at nice weather that you can get out there and enjoy some of the birding. Just be mindful, though, you're going to want your sunscreen when you head out, or at least don't forget your ball cap at a minimum. Now for today, you're going to find that highs, they're going to be very seasonal into those lower 70s. We're going to have mostly sunny skies and those temperatures are really going to start to climb now that we're into the stretch of dry weather and plenty of sun. That sunset again, that's going to be at 842. I'm planning on enjoying every minute of it and I'm sure I'm not alone. We're all excited to see some dry weather and we'll keep that in the forecast as we go into Wednesday and Thursday with those temperatures climbing. But then we're back into the 70s because here it is again, some of those rain showers. You're going to find that we even have showers and thunderstorms in for your Friday, Saturday, just a few, but the better chance is going to be on Sunday. Either way, we're going to be watching for that rainfall towards Mother's Day weekend, and then you're going to see just a few showers on Tuesday. Otherwise, though, the forecast is pretty quiet, hopefully a little more sun. Of course, we'll battle it out with the clouds. We're used to doing that at this point in the season, and then we do get back into those 70s after that 68 on Tuesday. So it's a good rebound, <laughs> and it's seasonal, but... Yeah. It's been a little tricky to get into mm -hmm. the heat here lately. And, you know, with the weekends, you know, we would like that to, you know, stack up a little differently. But. Yes, of course, we have Mother's Day this weekend, but mm -hmm. there's a lot of fun that's now coming our way yes. in the warm season. So we got to dry out the weekends. Hopefully we can get this pattern to switch up here soon. I think it'll happen. I think so, too. There's still a lot of June, July yeah. and August weekends to have some fun. Yep, very good, Diane. Thank you.